Chargers. Oh, okay. Fesco Field at Mile High is our site for what should be an excellent game between San Diego and Denver. Now we'll go to Tom Hammond and Chris Collins for the opening kickoff. Tom? Both teams will have to contend with a snowy, cold condition as we get ready for tonight's game. Tom Hammond and Chris Collins with here. Thanks for joining us. Chris, looks like the weather will be an issue. And I look to see this favor the offense slightly. It'll be harder on those pass rushers to get off the line of scrimmage. That should buy a little bit more time for the quarterback in the pocket. Royal takes it at the 12. Chris, what are your thoughts on this one? We should see both of these teams trying to establish a good balance on offense in this one. Whoever can do that should be able to win this thing. And he will score. What a return. What do you think about that one? There is nothing more exciting in football than a kickoff return for a touchdown. Sometimes you can say, well, maybe that was a little lucky. Uh -oh. That one was a great plan, and they executed it. Up and good. Denver gives up a touchdown. Here's the kick. down at the 24-yard line. You always want to have a successful first drive. It really sets the tone for the whole game offensively. Let's see how they do here. First down, looking to throw. He throws on the run. Oh, and he dropped. Jackson was his intended target on that one, but they can't complete the pass. Second down now with 10 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. He drops back to pass. Looking for an open man. There for the reception. He's tackled around the 42-yard line. Great pickup for the first all backwards. And really what makes NFL football so special is the ability of these quarterbacks to throw it and these great receivers to catch it. That's just fun to watch. Drops back on first down. He throws it. Why? Here's the pick. What a hit. And just a great interception by the quarterback. Might want to start thinking about trying to pick on that guy. We've seen all day he has simply been quicker to the spot than the wide receivers coming into his area. Get up to the tailback. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. No gain. That brings up second down. A lot of playmakers on offense for Denver. Here are just a few. Young is the single setback. Play action. Passes to his left. Out of bounds, incomplete. It looked like he tried it. Cutler fakes the gift. He's scrambling. Passes it to the middle. He's dropped at the 38. Good yardage that time on the pass. And that was a little hum baby coming out of there from the quarterback. We've all heard about how strong his arm is, and we saw it there. 
Again with the run. And they get him at the 32-yard line. They call his number and he carries for six yards. Second down now, four yards to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. Play fake. Now he's scrambling. Deep throw. End zone. Makes the catch. Touchdown. The defense just seemed to fall apart from that trip. Well, I really think they're struggling here trying to decide do we go after the quarterback? Do we play coverage? Right now, they're not doing either one very well. This should add the extra point. It's good. Here's a quick look at the drive summary. The kick. Drop at the 22. It'll be interesting to see how this quarterback reacts after throwing an interception on his last drive. They'll set up shop at the 22-yard line. The defense is in the dime. There are three down linemen. He looks to throw on first down. Looking for a receiver. Makes the catch. Brought down at the 41-yard line. They pick up solid yardage there. And I love to watch this wide receiver work. He is so patient with his routes. He gets down low into his cuts. And he really understands what the defense is trying to do to take him away. And he is working them over. On play action. Into traffic. And it's picked off. And he probably should have never thrown the ball. You know, Tom, there are some plays that your coaching staff will tell you, listen, we lost. You know when you step back there and hit that back foot, we lost that play. Just don't make it a disaster. Throw that thing away. Drops back on first down. Looks down the field. All kinds of pressure. And he made a great open field tackle. And he tucked that one away for about five yards. They line up at the 40. Young alone in the backfield. Cutler sends a man in motion. On the ground with a tailback. Tackle around the 41 yard line. The running back gets about a yard, maybe less. Young is the single setback. On play action, scans the field, and they're coming after him. He gets knocked out of bounds at the 45. Three, maybe four yards on the scramble. They line up at the 45. This is a very questionable play call here. I'm not sure I agree with it. Scramble. Short throw to the left. Great open field tackle. Eight of five on the play. First and ten. The backfield is in the offset I formation. Sam motioning to the run. They give it to the tailback. He's brought down at the 47-yard line. Young gains around three yards on the run. Second and seven. Ball on the 47. The Broncos come out with the offset on. Sap moves in motion. Back to throw. He tries to scramble. And it's incomplete. From the 47-yard line. 
gets away. Rockets it out. He's tackled at about the 33-yard line. And a big catch for the tight end. And I can tell you this, there's nothing the defensive backs hate more than to have one of those big tight ends in the open field running right towards him. Two tight ends here. He looks to throw on first down. Looking for an open man. Makes the throw out to his left. And they get him at the 13. Pretty good game right there. Yeah. Many people on this offense that you have to account for the tight ends, the wide receivers, the running backs, even the quarterbacks, and now they're throwing to the fullback. That's almost not fair. Still a lot of time left, but at the end of one, the score is 14 0. Broncos. Drops back on first down. He rolls right. And he's out of bounds. Incomplete. Sure looks like that play is worth another look, Chris. Why don't you break it down for us? They line up at the 13. And he goes down. The Broncos line up with three receivers. The quarterback in the shotgun. Cutler takes it back. Looking for a receiver. And he caught it. He's in for the score. And the wideout has his second touchdown reception. And we're only in the first half, Chris. And his hands are so strong that he really doesn't have to worry so much about catching the ball. You can see as soon as he catches the ball, he has his eyes on the pylons, and he's going in for the score. The snap. Set down, the kick is up. And now we'll take a quick look at the drive somewhere. Kicks it off. Drill at the 23. Quarterback threw a pick on their last drive. Let's see if he's able to shake it off. Rivers, four receivers lined up here. Looks to pass. He throws left. Stiff arms, and the defender still makes the tackle. And a nice pass to the tight end. So much of the game today revolves around those substitution packages, trying to bring extra defensive backs on the field to try and help against the pass. But when you have a big receiving tight end, that really makes that play an awfully tough to execute. From their own 34-yard line. The backfield is in the offset eye formation. Gives to the back. They tackle him for a loss. Nowhere to go for the halfback. That's a loss of one. Third and ten. Nickel back in this time. Back to throw. Gets rid of the ball. They don't hook up. And the pass will fall incomplete. Fourth down coming up. And those are the kind of big Fourth third down. down plays you have to have on defense to get the ball back and give your team a chance on offense. Mm -hmm. Hudson. Royal fields it at the 30. He's dropped at the 39-yard line. This offense seems to have found its stride as they take the field again after their last two successful drives. Oh, 
They motion to the left. Drops back on first down. Looks for a man open. Throws on the run. He leaves. It's caught. Throws down at the 41 yard line. He had a nice pick up there. Nice play that time. The defense came with blitz there. He made a good read, delivered a nice ball in there to the open man. The backfield is in the offset eye formation. Fullback straight ahead. He's brought down at the 34. Seven yards there, and that will bring up second down. They line up at the 34. Offset eye formation in the backfield. He drops back. Throws it short. It's there for the cap. He's dropped in the open field. That pass is good for a first down. And he had some zip on that one, didn't he? He reared back and threw that one about as hard as he could. From the 28-yard line, Denver is going with the offset eye backfield. Sam is the man in motion. Setting up play action. Dumps it out right. He's tackled at the 17. He got that one in there for the first down, didn't he? He really did. And when you watch a guy throw a ball that hard, they don't move their arm any faster. You see him driving off that back leg. That was a pretty pass. Gives it off. He gets in for six. Mike just found some daylight and got it in for six. I always say making the hole is the hard part. If you give any one of a number of backs a hole that side, they're going to be able to pop it in there for a touchdown. Nice blocking there by the big guys. He kicks it. They get there to bring him down. They were forced to punt on their last run. The offense will take over at the 14. First and 10. San Diego will line up in a jumbo set here. Yeah, how about that too? Rivers hands off to the left. He tries to spin, but he's brought down. A couple of yards there. That'll bring up second down. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 16. The Chargers line up in a goal line formation. And he's brought down. Tomlinson gains about a yard on the play. From their own 17-yard line. Offset eye formation in the backfield. He lost yardage on the play. Dawkins had a tough time picking up all their blocks on that play. You, know, you can draw up any sort of protection scheme and blocking scheme that you want. But ultimately, this game comes down to one big man against another big man. And that time, the defense's big men, they won the battle. Time out. The Broncos called a timeout. And now they've only got one remaining. Fourth down. The Chargers ready to punt this one away. He punts it. Makes the fair catch. This defense has been getting steamrolled out there. They get a sense from their body language that they're not excited about facing this offense again. Ace backfield this time. It's the tailback. He's dropped at the 40. 
This running back just showed off some nice ability there. Yeah, the offensive line did their job. They created enough of a scene to get him up into the secondary, and then he was oh. able to explode from there. Oh. He scrambles away for the score. Pass is complete. Well, the Broncos will continue to punch it in. And pass just wait for six points. What a play. And that's really all about timing right there. When you have a big touchdown pass like that, you know it's perfectly executed and thrown right on time. And that was well done. Up and good. Wow. Denver is winning big. Here's the kick. Scrolls from the three. He's hammered at the 27. Very impressive first half of football. Our score, the Broncos, 35. The Chargers, nothing. Thanks, guys. Here's a quick recap of some of the bigger plays of the first half. Great kick here. Drill at the 35. That return will set the offense up nicely. They did an outstanding job blocking for the returner, and he repaid their efforts for the huge game. Oh, so the Barrys is going to be low, huh? It, I might want to go and charge just a few minutes. Play action. Comes down with it. He's brought down at the 46-yard line. They just couldn't get to the quarterback in time. It's one of the dangers. You bring those extra defenders trying to get after the quarterback, and you're going to leave some man coverage on the outside. That time, the quarterback able to take advantage. They're going to pitch it. He's hammered in the outfield. Looked for a seam, but he wasn't able to find anything. And let's give credit to the defense. They had a great push there. They got in the backfield, took control of their own gaps. The Chargers line up with 3-1. He drops back. And it's caught. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown. It looked like everything worked to perfection on that one, Chris. Well, this receiver may not be the fastest guy in the world, but he certainly knows how to work a defense. And you can tell this quarterback believes in him. He stayed with him, and they hit it beautifully for a touchdown. <laughs> He missed it. Well, he's going to... Did he get an extra point? Wait. It's good. Oh. And we'll take a quick look at the drive somewhere. Oh. And here's the kick. Paul fields it at the 11. Hit and drop at the 30. So as the offense hits back home to the field, we'll take this time to remind you that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. If it's in the game, it's in the game. They get it out there on the toss. At the 40, at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown. That's his second score of the game, Chris. Yeah, it was, but the defense just looked like they were out of sync on that last play. They haven't been sharp the entire game, to be honest. There's got to be some miscommunication, failed gap responsibility, because they're just running the ball too consistently against this defense. Kick here. Oh. 
Drill at the 17. The passing game led to a touchdown on their last drive, and you've got to think they won't deviate from what's been working. He looks to throw on first down. It's completed. He's tackled at the 32-yard line. Nice little pitch and catch with the wideout. Patience for a wide receiver is just so key. He's able to manipulate that defense, set him up one play, come back with the exact same look, and break off of it the next. Beautifully run. They'll throw on first down. Passes the ball. Oh. He's taking bounds, incomplete pass. He couldn't get two feet in on that. Well, that's something receivers work on all the time, dragging that back toe, just unable to do it that time. <laughs> He's looking to throw. He throws a bullet. And they can't connect. I'm not sure who he was throwing it to on that last play. Third, yeah, even third the receiver was looking third around out. after that play and going, was that the big? San Diego comes out in the shotgun. <laughs> Drops back to pass. Hit him right in the hands and he dropped it. Chambers wasn't able to bring it in. Incomplete pass on the play. So, it's fourth down. The Chargers ready to punt this one away. <laughs> he punts it. Royal takes it at the 36. Down the sideline. And the last guy gets it. That was a complete breakdown of the covers there. Yeah, I don't know if I would say complete. They did at least chase him down, though, before he scored. These guys have got to start doing a little bit better job on this kick coverage team, though. The Broncos use motion. Cutler will hand it off. Brought down at about the 19-yard line. A seven-yard play. That brings up second down. They'll need about three yards here on second down. The backfield is in the offset I formation. Now he's scrambling. Looks like the defense might have been a little too aggressive there. Here's the call. This one goes against the defender. Yeah, and I can't really blame the defender in that situation. He's trying to go for the ball. The offensive guy makes a little move for the ball. He ends up running through him. It just happens sometimes. Denver uses motion. And he's crushed at the five. What can they do to slow his pursuit down? This guy's really one of the strengths on this defense. Not only is he able to turn the corner and get some pressure on the quarterback, but he's rock solid against the run. Sets up the play action. Brings this one in. Brought down behind the line. He stopped behind the line for a loss of one. Well, that's just great anticipation by the defense there. They saw that play coming and were all over it. Offset I formation in the backfield. Sam is the man in motion. Young gets the ball left side. Drop behind the line. Tried the run, but there was nothing available. And if you can make a running back hesitate just a little, that time you could see there really was no hole, and the running back was just fishing for a place to go. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. Here's a quick look at the drive summary. The kick is away. He's tackled at the 27 yard line. They had to cut it away on their previous drive. They'll go to work at the 27. 
two tight end formation this time. He threw up his back foot. Can't hang on. He can't complete the pass. Now the offense will be looking at second down. Second down now with 10 to go. Ball on their own 27. He drops back. He throws right. And he catches it. Inside the 30. Another touchdown to add to this already huge lead. What a play to slip out of the backfield for the huge score. Wow, halfbacks that can play like wide receivers. I don't know how you play defensive back in this league anymore. What a play. Okay, it's really going to be annoying right now. Up and good. It's really going to be annoying right now. Here's the kick. I'm not playing around like that. Royal takes it at the 12. Ooh. At the 40. At the 40. To the 20. To the 10. And he will score a one return. And once again, they decided to kick it to him. And once again, he made the play. Oh, man, what a mistake. They would have been better off just kicking it out of bounds. Kick it to the guy in row three. He's not going to return it for a touchdown. The kick. Hit and dropped at the 31. Carried along by their dominant vertical game, they were able to put one in the end zone on their last drive. They'll take over at the 31. Single back formation, three wide receivers. Tomlinson gets the call. Tomlinson seems to be a little shaken up on that one. So they'll face a second and ten. Ball on the 31-yard line. The Chargers put a man in motion. Oh, no. Uh -uh, no. Back to throw. Pass is right. He's wide open. He's brought down around the 38-yard okay, line. I got it. The defense came with the blitz that time. And defensively, you just so, can't ask right. for any better coverage than that. They're right there, but when okay, you have yeah. a strong arm quarterback like that, that right now. sometimes he can squeeze it into holes that others can't. They'll work the left side, and they get him at the 37. A one-yard gain, and that will bring up second down. And we might start to see some backups come in as they have this one well in hand. Our score, the Broncos, 52, the Chargers, 14. Offset eye formation in the backfield. Looking to throw. Throws wild on the run. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. Nice little pickup on that pass pattern. And I really shouldn't feel this way, but I get a little nervous every time this guy goes up to make a catch, you know, because he's had a little bit of a history of dropping some balls, but today doing a nice job hanging on and a big play there. They'll throw for the first. Throw short. Tackle at the 23. Nice heads up play by the quarterback. I agree. I like the way he stepped up and delivered that throw. He just simply is taking what the defense is giving him. Rolls alone in the backfield. Nice sir. Uh, if I get an interception, should I should I get an interception? On the run, he throws it. Woo! He's gotta find a way to hold on. 
Second down now, following the incomplete pass. Almost interception. They line up at the 23. The Chargers Almost line up interception. With oh my the gosh. Back to pass. No, 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 no. Rifles this one out to the right. They bring him down, and it's first and goal. Good pickup by the receiver. And we've always talked about this receiver's big play ability. He may not be the fastest guy in the league, but you can tell he wants the ball in his hands in big situations. Oh, he drops back to pass. Ah. will score. The tight end hauls in another one, getting him two touchdowns on the game. And it's so difficult. You try and take away the wide receivers. You try and take away the big threats outside, and the tight end just kills you. Kick is up. Point after is good. And now we'll take a quick look at the drive summary. Had enough already. Like for real. Hating will try to hit this ball just right to get a good bounce for the onside kick. Here's the onside try. Drop at the 39 yard line. Well, I would say this one is just about wrapped up. If you ask me, this one's been over for quite a while. Maybe they just wanted to practice the onside kick. Didn't make a lot of sense. Cutler sends a man in motion. <laughs> on play action. Sacked on the play. They hurry to the line. Denver finds up in the offset eye this time. Marshall moves in motion. He fakes it. He scrambles around. What? And they drop him. Denver is going with the offset eye backfield. Sets up the play action. Scans the field. Left side. Going deep. Almost hit. Play action. And they get to him. That was a great job by the quarter to get him on the blitz. If a quarterback's really good, he can anticipate that corner blitz because he sees the coverage shift over to that side. Obviously, you can't blitz a corner and leave the guy that. open without shifting the coverage. That time, the quarterback had no idea. They get to him on fourth. <sighs> fourth and long now after the sack. Looks down the field. Sees a man. Goes deep. He's dropped at the 28-yard line. Ooh. How about that pass play? I love seeing those little touch passes. Ooh, like that. I that, mean, was that close. is just a thing of beauty. It takes so much work to get that kind of timing down between a quarterback and receiver. Stokely. <laughs> he fakes it. Scrambles. Throws it short. Completed. And Denver is in for the score. At this fourth pass for a touchdown. They'll look to tack on the extra point. Up and good. Here's your drive summary for that last series. And here's the kick. Drilled at the 23-yard line. Their previous two trips downfield were a success, and they take the field hoping for a third. Please come on. Please come on. Please come on. They'll throw on first down. 
short throw. Makes the grab. And I have a feeling this one's coming back. Oh. It looks like you got a handful of jersey on that ball. When you hold with your hands, the ball <laughs> and the holding is created by not moving your feet. They're clearly... He didn't get his feet in position, so he had no choice but to hold. Rivers sends a guy in motion to the right. He's looking to throw. Surveys the field. Abdullah gets the interception. He's brought down at the 44 yard line. Well, almost clear one. Today. You know, one of the really misleading stats in football is completion yards. If you're throwing it up and down the field but turning it over, it just doesn't matter. You have to maintain possession of the ball. Here for the catch. Two minutes left in the ball game. The wide receiver and the quarterback are on the same page today. Yeah, and this wideout really is something special. He's able to find the holes in the coverage. He gets good separation, and he has tremendous hands. They give it to the tailback. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. They finally get him, and it looked like he would score, but instead they'll set it up with first and goal. Young takes the give. They had no problem finding the end zone today, and they'll add another score. For the third time in the game, he finds Peter. And your offensive line is getting this much push late in the game. It speaks volumes about their conditioning. Offensive linemen are supposed to be big guys, but look at them. They're still out there playing like it's the first quarter. And we'll take a quick look at the drive summary. Nice kick, plenty of distance. the 30. Trolls might have been shaken up a bit on the play. First and 10. San Diego lines up in a shotgun set. Throw on first down. Knocked loose. Jackson is the intended receiver on the play, and it falls incomplete. From their own 35 yard line. Denver brings in the nickel here. Gates in motion. Drops back to pass. Fly knocks it away. Chambers was the intended target on that incomplete pass of Denver's. Two extra defensive backs out there on this one. Might have been hurt on that one, but it appears it isn't too serious. What? So with that penalty, they'll move the chain. Ah, oh, that's so painful for a defense to make a stop, get the ball back for your offense, uh, and just a silly penalty is going to give it right back to them with a first Oh, down. no, no, no. I'm sorry. Under heavy pressure. Uh, looks like they caught the defense offside. Here's the rest. Oh, sorry. Oops, I didn't mean to do this stuff. My my fault. He tried to anticipate the count. Ah. And a lot of times it's the offensive okay, lineman so. who will go back into the huddle and say, hey, right. I think this guy's trying to time our snap count. That's when the quarterback right. will change up the right. count. Worked perfectly there. Dumps it out right. No connection this time. Gates was the intended receiver, and he can't bring it in. From the 49 yard line. Rivers is in the gun. Four wide formation. Oh, yeah. He drops back to pass. Bailey gets his hand on it. 
Chambers wasn't able to bring it in. Incomplete pass on the play. So another third down upcoming for the offense. The Broncos line up with a nickelback. Looks to pass. Looking for an open man. What a shot. And that one will go for a first. And really top notch first quarterbacks down. know how to throw a football Come on, Stop. leading his receiver into trouble. That was a great throw. Sets up the play action. Brings it in. Tackle at the seven. He's put up some nice yardage kick. He sure has, but throwing for 300 yards probably isn't quite the same feat it used to be. You know, there's so many rule changes now. The offensive linemen can do a little more holding, use their hands more. Of course, you can't hit the receivers, but it's still a nice landmark. Makes the reception. He's tackled at the five-yard line. Ain't a couple through the air. A lot of times in that situation, they try to get the ball in the receiver's hands, hoping he'll make one guy miss and get away. That time, good tackle. It's picked off. That should wrap things up. <laughs> well, the Broncos will continue to punch it in. What a huge turn of events on that one. Not only was that a tremendous interception, but when he got the ball in his hand, he looked like he knew what to do with it. What a run. It's good. And we're in control. The kick. <laughs> Defense pushes him out of bounds at the 24-yard line. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. Gates motioning to the right. He's looking to throw. The defense has him surrounded. Oh, and they got him. And I'm sure he's one of these teams is happy to see this one is. Our final score, the Broncos 73, the Chargers 21. Thanks. And here's a look at your key plays in this game. Thanks again for joining us for this EA Sports matchup. For Tom.